Mike Van Dusen. Welcome back to Keep On Growing. Um, Happy New Year, right? Isn't this fantastic? Uh, I hope you guys had a great 2021. I sure did, and, and mostly in part it's because of y'all. And I'm really looking forward to 2022. I hope you guys are too. We've got a lot of fantastic things planned. We're going to start off by checking out five free containers that I like to grow plants in. We're going to combine two of my favorites into the first one, and it's these ramen containers and the milk jugs. Now I grow a lot of things with these from microgreens to seedlings, but I also use these to root my cuttings from plants like basil and mint and even your tomatoes. And you guys know I like using pool noodles in hydroponics. And I love these almond milk jugs. They're, they're perfect, just the right size. And they've got these labels that just peel right off. So nice and clean look, awesome. I also love using these protein drink containers because they come with a free spoon that you can use to measure your nutrients. All right, and just real quick, another fantastic thing that's happening this year is that our products are going to be on Amazon now instead of Etsy. The fantastic thing about that is that I think it's going to be available in Canada. Now, I've already sent some of these end caps in, and there's only three available right now when I'm shooting this video because Amazon gets it and they check them into the warehouse and then they distribute it among their warehouses so that it's closer to a lot of people. So that when you order it, if you're a Prime member, you're gonna get free shipping. If you order it, it doesn't take that long to get to you. So they're, they're taking them and moving them around whatever Amazon does, right? So at this moment, uh, I think I checked in, there's three of them available. But if one of my Canadian friends could go over and check the link down in the description, you don't have to buy it, uh, just at least check it and see if it's available in Canada. And just leave me a note and say yes or no if it is. And that way I'll know because I've sent some of these downspout growers in too, waiting for those to get checked in. And I'm real excited because I think that I have it set up so that we can ship to Canada too. So that's awesome. That's gonna help me out immensely because um, I get orders coming in like every day and I'm having to process orders, pack stuff up, print shipping labels, go up to the post office and rinse and repeat daily now what i'll be able to do with amazon is just get a bunch of product like this put it in one box and take that box to ups and send it in and then amazon will distribute it among their warehouses and when you order they'll take it they'll pack it and ship it out to you right away now one quick downside is that the downspout grower that has this and the end caps the pool noodles i usually throw in a little free sample of the master blend uh, that's just to get you going, you know, five gallons will only get you so much and then you're gonna have to order some more. The ones that we're shipping to Amazon, I'm not gonna include that because you're on Amazon anyway. So if you order this, you can go ahead and just order the kit that's on there too. And then you have enough to make hundreds of gallons and not just five gallons. All of these products are gonna soon be on Amazon. So right now, 
If you guys are interested, last chance, if you want this with the free sample of the Master Blend, go ahead, jump on the description down below. They're still on sale. So this last batch that we do is going to include the Master Blend. After that, it, everything's going to be on Amazon, and you'll have to uh, purchase them separately. But it all works out, you know, for the better. Now, I know a lot of you grow in these coffee containers. This is great. This is perfect. This is like the protein drink containers but I also love coffee jars now you can paint them all black with chalkboard paint so that you can change it whenever you need to or check this out So I love these coffee jars. You can use just about any jar you can find or mason jars. They're durable. They last forever. You know, if you don't drop them and break them, you can cover them with foil like this to block out the light. Uh, you could paint them black with chalkboard paint so you can draw on it. Or you could even just cover it with burlap or something that looks nice. Someone out there even uh, covered one with a black sock, I think, or something to block out the light. It works, right? Just that. A pool noodle, some nutrients, and you're growing your own food. Awesome. And my last one, number five, is one of my favorites, is a bucket. Now, this is a common object that just about anyone has, and you could go out and buy them, but you could also get them free. There's a lot of people out there that know someone that works in a bakery or a deli, um, and they're just throwing these away, and lots of you have gotten them free. At least we used to years ago. When they found out that people wanted them, they started wanting a little bit of money for it. So some places charge like a dollar or something pretty cheap. So if you know someone out there that works in the food industry, they might be able to get you some free. I know someone who just got about 20 or 30 or 40 of them and, and they've got buckets all over the place. So um, keep your eyes and ears open and who knows, you might be able to score some free buckets. All right, wasn't that cool? Now, you guys let me know down in the comments if you grow on free stuff like this too. What kind of containers do you use? Do you use the same as me or do you use something different? And I just think that's awesome. I love upcycling things. I like taking things that are going to end up in the landfill and doing something fantastic with it. See, it's not all about just buying things. You, you can go out and you can buy hydroponic supplies. You can buy a bunch of equipment and you can grow fantastic food. But not all of us are in a position to do that. And if you're not, I want to show you guys free ways that you can do it too. In fact, even these downspouts, you know, the end caps, I would love if you all bought those. Or if you go to the World Grace Project and you buy some from her and help out her nonprofit, you know, I'd love that too. But we still want to help people out too. If you have a CNC machine, which some people do, it's like a 3D printer. It's a little router uh, that if you need the code, on how to do these you know just email me a couple of you have already done that and and I'll just give you the code and you can cut your own uh, like we said you know it's, it's not all about the money it's this is about a greater reach this is like trying to teach the world you know how to feed itself and, and we're not gonna do that by just trying to sell stuff to everyone right so if you need some help feel free to reach out um, these things are on sale if you are able to and you want to you know go down there and check those out if not there's always free stuff that you can use to grow your own food. So this is something that anybody can do and everybody should be doing. So you guys keep spreading the word. We want everyone in the world to be growing some of their own food, living a better life. You guys, as always, live to inspire, keep on growing, and be the change. Happy 2022. Bye.